Hello everyone, and welcome back to Romance of the Three Kingdoms 14, Gathering of Heroes campaign. Today, we're going to continue our veteran difficulty campaign as Lu Bu. As you can see from the last episode, I went from 69 active officers to 175. My powers increased dramatically after defeating the evil Cao Cao in battle. So, a bit of history lesson. After much struggle, we capture Runan. Then after even more struggle, as you can see with these stone soldiers turning this place into the Stonehenge. Finally, Xu Chang has fallen. And with that, we took on our last momentum over to Chen Lao. Taking that, and finally, finally subduing Cao Cao's forces. Afterwards, we took on our longtime rivals, Liu Dai and Kong Rong. And of course, the evil Yuan Shu, who's been bothering me the most while I was in the middle of fighting Cao Cao. It's been a really horrendous campaign of a uh, battle on four fronts. But luckily for me, I was able to defeat the enemy forces because they weren't attacking me too seriously. They were just kind of watching me and Cao Cao duke it out so that maybe they can sweep in and uh, take advantage of it. Well, as a result, this is what happened. <laughs> After defeating Cao Cao, I just went ahead and killed them both. And, no, killed all three of them. Now, another thing I'm going to do is I have went and asked Sun Jian to surrender. I literally just sent Sun Yu to go to Sun Jian and tell him, you know what, you need to get on your knees. And of course, right as I was doing that, Sun Jian, who's my buddy right now, decides that he's going to give me some money and increase our friendship to each other. Well, that just buttered up my chances some more. Now, the others currently are not as amicable, shall we say. So we're going to go and um, toss them a little gold here and there and see if they will um, change their mind. If they change their mind, great! If they don't, we're going to... Um, Let's just say we're going to pay them a visit. We're going to pay them a visit, indeed. So I'm going to give them a little bit of gold. I'm going to even have sent Cao Cao over to give them a little bit of gold. It's not like we're doing anything right now. So we're going to give them a little bit of gold until my troops arrive. Ding, you need to get some gold. How much gold do I have left? And I have 25k gold. That's good. I have plenty of gold. So I'm going to visit these people, give them a little bit of gold. I've already given some gold to Yuan Xiao and Gong Sun Zan. I'm going to give some gold to um, <laughs> Gong Sun Du as well. And basically, I'm going to put in this letter of gold that you should surrender. If they don't, well, I'm going to pay them a visit in another way. I'm going to beat them and take gold from them. So they should probably surrender. It would be a good idea. Now, I have given gold to pretty much everyone here. Oh, wait. Did I give any to Han Fuck You? No, I haven't. Let me give some to Han Fuck You. All right, Han Fuck You. Here's 4,000 gold. See? Look, I, we're troubled, but I am... I'm a forgiving man. I'm a forgiving monarch. And, uh... You know... I recognize that you may have accidentally came to my land. And so... I am willing to forgive your past transgressions. And... Let you live. As long as you... Raise my banner. And then that's it. No problem. Now, if Sun Jian is willing to surrender then we will have opened up a whole new theater of war. Currently, I have prepared to invade anyway, but I was waiting for reinforcements to arrive so that I can go. If Sun Jian surrenders, then I can go and attack Jian Yi instead and take down Wu and all the other places. I might just give him some money too. Actually, you know what? Let's give him more money. A little bit of money. <laughs> all right. How about some money? Xiao Shun, you need to give him some money. Yeah, 
Gun by who? Some money. What you thought? See, I am very generous. I can't even believe how generous I'm being right now. I am out of control. I just gave that man like 5,800 to that. Oh, I nice, saw uh, 5,000. Good, 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 good. good. Uh, but I gotta calm down with that now. Alright, so now, my next step afterwards is to um, see how they respond. Now. Oh, but I do need some gold after what I just did. 5,000, 10,000. 15,000 gold. I'm gonna make a withdrawal from my bank. Yeah, who better to go and transport gold than you? I have no gold. Oh, hey, you have 10k gold. You gotta. Yeah, you can't give them any. That's okay. Uh, um, Orders. It's okay, I'll just... It may have accidentally too much gold. It's okay, I still have 5,000 left. I, I might need this gold, because um, this gold is going to be important for me to uh, elicit surrender. Or rather, what happens afterwards. I'm going to uh, put you in prison. Put you in prison. I've captured this officer. What good you? Stop your feudal and okay, well then go to prison. See look, this is perfect. This is the whole system working out for me. Here you go, see no problem. With Sun Yu's smooth talking, Su Jian would not need too much persuading. Okay, let's see. It's an honor to meet you. I, Sun come as an emissary on behalf of my lord. Who? What matter do we need to discuss? I will hear what you have to say. Submit to us and save many lives. This matter is not even up for discussion. We should flatly refuse. Very well, I shall submit. Uh, let it wait from my shoulders. Let's work hard together. Soon Jian Army received a request to surrender from the Bu Army. In April 255, Soon Jian Army collapsed. Oh god, it's terrible. Until we look forward to the continued friendship. I ask that you take your leave. Wow! Wow! That is unfortunate. That may mean we may be enemies in the near future. Refused a gift. I've never seen anyone refuse gifts before. It's practically free. Even if you ha hate me. Even if you hate me. There's no reason for you to refuse this gift. Alright then. Okay. Well, you're gonna play like this then. Well, we gotta play like this. I uh, like how this entire island, just peninsula, just mutated into a different color. City info, please. Right now, the governor is gunning. Though it should be Su Jian. It seems like I like gunning a little more. I have taken his entire army of officers into my command. Well, I'm not gonna stash them all in one island. Blue Island, I'm gonna go and spread them out a little. First things first, though, I'm gonna have to give those people ranks that I have just captured. Let's see. Record Secretary, please step forward. So you and Lu Sun. Perfect. That's perfect. Oh, wouldn't 
Officer of Strategy. Sun Jian. Sun Che. Sun Jian should be the one. Officer of Strategy. Dian Wei and Wen Yu. Zhu at these other positions. Oh, they'll probably ne not evolve beyond that. I gave him that, but I kind of regret ever did. Lieutenant. Sun Che. Do I have any more vacant spots? Unfortunately, we have no more vacant officers, so... We need a rank. Mm. Why don't we wait until we uh, stabilize a little? Because I'm going to give ranks eventually again, anyway. Zhang Hong, uh, yeah, that dude. <laughs> he did not want to join me end up finding soon family joining them well, now fate has well, brought us back you. together shall we say <laughs> okay well I need to um, have dramatic amount of gold to um, continue giving to my people so I'm gonna have to um, ask you to give me your, all your gold oh but you don't even have that much hmm. You have dramatic amount of gold, but you could ask for some. But... The mission demand. Unfuck you. Oh. I like how Han Xuan would just straight up join me. Okay. Wu Yao, okay. Oop, Yao. Zhuo. Ma Chao. Yeah, the Wild West. I don't think they would, they would join that easily. Zhao Fan. Ooh, Sima Yin. Unsweet. Little Kai. Uh, it's just, those guys are a million miles away. But, Han Xuan will surrender? If we leave it to Lu Xun, we can get this done. Let's go and make it happen then. Baba. I will go and show them the path to survival. Surrender. Show them. <laughs> he gives me this determined look that he will show them. Alright, I'm gonna give you another you know, little bit of gold. Just to show that uh, I'm not messing around. Here's, here's this. This 1,000 gold contains a secret meaning in poetry. You better surrender or else you will die. Of course, that's... Uh, I don't know any actual poetry, so that's just gonna have to do now, what is the loyalty of the people here? Oh, there's a merchant here. If only I can use this merchant. Oh, well. How did Gunning get such a high rank? One hundred, one hundred, ninety-seven, ninety-seven. We probably don't need to worry about getting poached except for, like, Zhang Hong. Jiang Gan or something like that, but everyone else, they probably will be okay. Now, let's go and um, put them somewhere else, like in these cities or something. I mean, we're going to need people to occupy these places later. I mean... I suppose I could keep them around. And then when um, I take a couple cities, they can uh, manage it a little. Especially if Han Xuan were to say surrender. <clears throat> well, I suppose I could transfer a couple. Let's see here 16, 11, 11, 13, 12. 
10, 18. Oh my god, dude. I feel like the problem with this game, I mean, with this campaign, is that it's um, designed for... I guess for this game, yeah. It's designed for not having that many officers out at the same time. You know, people die out and such. But right now we have a bit of a... Um, Oh, population problem. Oh, it's okay. I'll toss a couple over there and here and there. Ship you guys over to where it's, you know, not, not very uh, dangerous. Uh, this is for, like, second third stringers and, and stuff like that. You know, you people who... Oh, wow. Quite, quite some stats you've got there. You people who... You know, would be safer or in these places and territory, much like that. Okay, I think I should stop now. I feel like I've said too many. Hey, look, there's two Soongis. Isn't that great? Let's, they both get to go there. And then there's two Soongas. One of them is the successor, and one of them is some other dude, and there's two Sunhuans. Oh my god, dude, that's like Noah's Ark of refugees I'm sending over there. Alright, I've sent mm, 27 people, and one guy will lead the Ark. You know what, let's just even it out. Let's give uh, three more guys over. Unshio, Unshin, Unquang. See, look, now we have 30 people to ship over to one of these places, and... And now, Chao Pi will distribute them to other places and have them do manual labor. And even now, we still have, like, a lot of people in that place. Uh, let's see, there's 79 people in that place. So, uh, we're going to need to um, <clears throat> kick some asses and take these places here. And even if we don't kick asses, we like to um, keep it a little intact. I'm waiting for you to get your ass over here, and if Liu Yao seriously does not wish to surrender, then I guess I have no choice but to pay him a visit and tell him that you're going to die, scum. And that's exactly what's going to happen in just a little bit of time. Actually, as a matter of fact... <clears throat> None of them use siege weapons. Sending them Zhao Yu, Sun Jian, and Sun Che can go and um, use those. God. Out of pulled power. Catapult power. Gunning. Is it gunning to operate a catapult? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. You know, another thing I just realized is that now, because of what I just did, these people will actually have their, their treasures unmolested by me. Which, I guess it's okay. What, what am I going to take from these people? Take, well, I can't even check right now. But I'm pretty sure they have um, some really good treasures. It's probably... Um, let's see. He probably has his uh, blade. Wu Dao. Oh, maybe he doesn't. What the f... Not even Sun Tzu's... This is part of war? Okay, then. All right. Really? That's new to me. Did he, like, lose them or something? Oh, he did get captured, if I recall correctly, at some point. Oh, it might have been stripped from him. I think... Yupia was the one who did it. Well, whatever. We'll see what happens next. We probably won't be able to get everyone to surrender. It's just not possible. But, uh... We can... Definitely make some people surrender. Now, let's see here. I was still in the middle of looking through these. Um, so, 
catapult has been moved. Uh, I guess it's okay. We can we can leave it at this. We're gonna leave it at this. Yeah, Gunning and other guys over just gonna wait for it. Changxi's unit to arrive, and then we will begin our operation. In fact, we can even start early. I just kind of want to um, figure something out here. Yupi, I was trusted. I'm not gonna send Zhang Hong over this. Is um, not quite. He's not quite. Um, Pacified, shall we say. Let's go. One show. We also wish for a friendship between us and the Bu army. What do you need? Do we have a quest? Please attack ye. Oh, I like how it says decline, but probably said it wrong. It's honor to meet you. I, Cao Cao, has come as an emissary on behalf of my lord, Yu Bu. What we you have today? Hurry up and tell me. Gift. Please tell Li Bu we look forward to their continued friendship. Oh, thank you. Wow, only improved. I guess he doesn't really like me. Okay, that's fine. Everyone else is friendly. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Come on, you pieces of shit, get that supply over. Oh shit. This this, this is bad. Uh modify. See if I can't visit a merchant or something and sure. squeeze out some more time. There, we squeezed out more time. Very good, we done it. Now we can return this place over to Taopi. Oops, not what I need to be. I will go back there in a bit, but not right now. There we go. See, I'm so kind. I give Taopi all this land to rule. You should be thankful to me. Now, send some demands. Unfuck you. Oh. <laughs> Only you can pull it off? Really? In that case... First things first, I got to, uh... Ward. Uh. 
感激不尽。Pretty high up there in politics. Needs 27 days to get here. I could make them to um, surrender without without fighting. That would be most nice. Trusted alliance, friendly. One shower is a little tougher now. Seems like friendly isn't enough. Unfortunate, but it seems like I need to um, be a little closer to tell them a little, a little thing. Okay, let's see here. Unfortunate. <clears throat> you know, it's kind of funny when Han Fuck You is the only one I can get. But it makes sense. These people have like a lot of troops, so they won't likely surrender that. Because it's going to take him a while to, um, <clears throat> it's going to take him a little while to, uh, do this. He needs at least, like, four turns before we can actually do it. Oh, well. I sent for Alliance. Oh, yeah, that's right. Didn't I send for a uh, submission to man to Ansrin as well? Hmm. He surrenders. That'll surely shake those nearby people and make them wonder if their choice is actually the right choice. Tigers roar. Assault increased. Tigers claw. Assault increased. So it's about the same, isn't it? these territories now. Soon Jan and Soon Te will now begin the ex expedition against Yu Yao. And then... Next turn, once I get these troops over, I'll begin my own expedition over to um, other places. I guess I'll give you a little bit of money. Meanwhile, I'm getting a new shipment of soldiers arriving, so in four turns, everything will be determined.
I come today on behalf of my lord Nubu. You know who you want today? Submit to us and save many lives. Oh, we have no choice. We will submit. Then we learn during these turbulent times can be difficult. A fine decision. Lou Boob, you're very happy. Instrument army collapsed. <laughs> they collapsed in of themselves. What better way to do battle than to not even battle at all? And you be all allies with us. That means I won't be bothered while I execute my commands. I'm not gonna go too hard on this because that's kind of expensive. If friendly is not enough, then you know, you probably well, you are not enough. This little bit of money is also a threat. A veiled threat for you to give up or die. Now, that is what I'm going to be telling you people. And you people don't deserve any of it because I can crush you at any time. So, how about it? Submit. To you. Do excellently. Also a million miles away. Shit. Unfuck you. Trusted lions want to deal with the others at the moment, especially with Liu Biao serving as a natural barrier. Don't surrender. Yeah. I go too ham on this gift thing because uh, I'm not gonna have enough for myself if I go too ham on that. On the other hand, Liu Yao, you must die. I've already asked you a couple times, but since this is going to be a problem, I am unfortunately gonna have to. Regrettably tell you that you must die. Yang. Let's see if we don't need any more. <clears throat> what is the movement? 15 plus 1. 15, 15, 15. Five plus eight, Jesus, dude. I'm gonna go on a more um, slower adventure then. Seems like the um, the course to take here is to go with fish. Makes sense. We're trying to cross over a river here, so fish. Fish, fish, fish. Oh, hey, Dominic doesn't even have fucking rank. Wonderful. Let's try this again.
<clears throat> Sorry about your rank, but you know, these things happen. Alright, now, let's go and try this again. So, you. Xiao Dun. Tao Ren. Xu Wang Gan Ning. Going for fish army here. Sail across and do what you need to do. Still have this much troops left? Huh. Still have this much, huh? I mean, I guess I could have Xiao Yuan go uh, as um, vanguard. But we just go out in the front and surprise attacks. And or build a base early or some shit like that. But the main army will have to arrive a little later. Alright, no problem, we can do this. I feel like there's not much room to maneuver, though. I really do that with Zhao Yuan. Alright, let's see, who else can be used? Tao Zhen? Oh, hey, that's right, I have picked up Xu Sheng. He, he'd be perfect for this. Or, I can go for the, um, oh, ram thing. Actually, you know what, I might just do that. There's just not much room to maneuver. I, I like to do it, but there's just not much room. So here's what we're going to do. I give him such high ranks, too. I'm gonna have to give up these ranks for these guys. They're not really generals, more or less just um, people who kind of guard things. But I also think that the rank is a little too high, so maybe I'll come back to this. Later. No problem. Let's go! Once he gets here, he's gonna rip that wall in half. That is how we're going to take that place. have to actually manage this place. You know, I haven't even done that here yet. I've been kind of... <sighs> been kind of just running around telling people you should give up. Alright, Sun Yu, why don't you give it a try? It'll take you like 80 days to come back to me, but you know what? It's okay. It's okay. Take it, because I am... Not likely to wage war yet until this arrives. So that's gonna be a little bit of time. And I still gotta settle the score down here.
Got anything for Changsha? Maybe a banquet? I sound. Eh, I guess it's better not to do it. Yeah, you want to do it. Oh, looks like I gotta head out for a bit. Let me just save real quickly and head out. Yep, I gotta go. Really early. I thought this would come a little bit later. I'll just come right back. Oh, wait, another message? Jesus Christ, is it to tell me that I don't have to go anymore? Oh no, I see how what it is. Oh, you gotta get here at like 40. Okay, alright, I guess I'll go now. <laughs> Be right back. Alrighty then, and now we're back. Let us continue. Like, given all the orders, my invasion plan has started. What else was there to do? I sent a surrender request down there. And, uh... Sure, why not? Got your son, too. Oh yeah, I actually forgot to give uh, Taisichi a rank. But you know what? We can wait a little bit. Taisichi has been on Thorn on our side for a while, and he's probably busy doing something else. We'll put him to work soon. Once he heals up, I saw him wounded. And what's the situation here? It seems like there's something going on. Tell me specifically. <laughs> what do you want? Tell me specifically. There you go. See, I am so generous. I can't believe how generous I'm being right now. I am the most generous man. Oh, yo, shipping go. See here. Okay, good. Everything is in order. Should have a little bit more time to play now. All right, now my army is ready to cross over. While this little thing is moving around. So let me ask you this. Now that I have, oh, I don't know, started coming down this way, perhaps you should give it up. Uga Jin. Alright, we're just gonna park him here. And if. Oh. They um, choose to not obey, then well, they're just gonna have to die. Anyway, if they do give up, then I will move on to convince other people. I'm a pretty convincing guy. I mean, you know, you get a job and you don't die. I think I think I'm very being really generous right now. <laughs> I really think I am, I might be a little bit too generous. Let's see who else should I give these demands to? Oh hey, too bad he's like a million miles away. Unfuck you. Okay, good. We can actually do that. Too bad they're a little in the middle of fighting. So once that's done, I'll end up having to fight them. I mean, that's not inherently bad. But it would be kind of nice if you guys um, It's okay. Once I start showing up at your door, you will reconsider your stance. First, I will get Han Fuck You to give it up. I'm waiting for my troops to arrive. Once they arrive, I can start sending them over to Yi. The man surrender. <laughs> it's like this turn just starts and there's like three demands going on. Amazing. This is a deplorable. Love it every second of it. Oh, 
Probably end up taking like all these kinds of well, look he gets his iron porcupine. Great. Well, I need my money, so I'm just gonna not do any of that. Wait, see what happens. Nice work maintaining this place for a bit. I'm going to ask you to make troops now. After all, how can you convince people to give up if you don't have troops? We're gonna shit lots and lots of it. Go! <laughs> I, Jonghol, has come here as an emissary for my Lord Dubu to speak with you. Oh, what you want? Submit to us and save many lives. Oh, wow. Giving in to such demands would leave our army in ruins. Ooh, we will submit. Oh, <laughs> it collapsed. His army went to ruins indeed, as he said. Grand Minister. Uh oh, it seems like there's a bit of a mistake. Med medium city locks at seven seventy thousand. See, we've got a lot of people now. Research burns, eliminate evade, adherence, counterattack would be useful, but right now I don't need to worry about that. For the people has been set. You know, I've been meaning to pick up some tall tall strategies. Pen and sword. No pen and sword. We have another pen and sword. Ah, uh, 55. Ah. Uh. Oh. Oh. 55. I guess we could lower it a little bit. It's either that or the herbal medicine, but then. Uh, strength and armed forces. Oh, hey. Combine yours and mine. Let's see. We currently have three. I'm three. And there's these threes. Do I have my own that it counts? So combine these. Strength and armed forces. And actually pack quite a few things. What did I just disable? Siege weapons, strength and arrow.
Well, it's one Young's arrow. I put back the ten. Now we have pen and sword five. We have a lot of support now. Get more pen and sword down the line. Make up with any incompetence with the wisdom at my disposal. Alright, and with this, I've made it to Yi. So, how about it? Give it up. Surrounding neighbors are not yet ready to give up after Han Fuck You has decided to give out up. I'm still waiting for um, this dude to get ready to give up. And once done, we will begin our next phase of the plan. For now, we will wait. Yes, for now, we will wait. This is really terrible, deplorable. Really deplorable. The fact that this is happening and the entire forces just surrenders to me is disgusting. <laughs> and now look, I give you some. We hunt fuck you, and then everything is okay again. So this is a medium city. A medium city can hold 70,000. Puyang Xing. <laughs> I like it that the Puyang Xing is living in Puyang right now. How wonderful! This is beautiful. I'll leave him there forever. Well, as long as my AI buddies don't move him around. Let's go hunting. Anyone who says no are going to get fucked. But if you say yes, you won't get fucked. I think I am very, very generous. I am a sh quite frankly shocked at how generous I am right being right now. I, I can't believe it. I am shocked. It, this isn't like me. Barracks. Oh wow, I took all of his gold too? Jesus. Man, well, we're gonna develop these lands into some crazy ass things soon enough. It is an honor to meet you, Zhuge Jin. Well, as an emissary on behalf of my Lord Bu. what do you want? If you do not wish to perish, please submit to Bu's army. 
please take cons careful consideration before you answer. Man, giving it a subject of man, we live in army ruins. We have no chance of winning, so winning is our only option. A fine decision, Dupu will be very happy. We our army collapsed. <laughs> Man, I'm like playing that game Tal Tal was playing before to be, except I'm actually successful at it. Doo -doo! Uh, I mean, Tal Tal did manage to get uh, Liu Song to give up. Are you still gonna advance despite this? You're crazy. I hope our uh, relationship is not gonna get hurt too much. After all, I did send someone to go and say, hey, uh, you know, maybe it's better if you just don't. Oh, people see this shit coming and they're like, you know what? This isn't right. <laughs> this isn't right. You don't see this shit coming, I think that they realize that this isn't. This is just not right. <laughs> this is. What you're doing here, that is not right. But now they're going to mass surrender. I might just have to park myself inside the castle and use that ridiculous amount of gold to um, pacify the people. Because I, 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 I'm going to run out of gold soon. I'm going to run out of gold real soon. This is actually a real problem. <laughs> the first world problems. All right, we show them a show of force. Now, move this army over to Yan Baifu. We're going to, we're going to say the same thing to them. And this is what I will also ask of you to do. I won't make a division yet, but uh, I will wait a second. I have to make sure I calm everyone down. You know, I'm, what I'm doing isn't exactly a, a, um, a natural thing. Yo, you. And I'm actually going to tell them all the surrender. That's terrible. All right, you guys see what this is? Go what's going on now? You guys see what the fuck is going on? Are you seeing this? Thirty-eight days. Whew, Thirty-eight days. Only you guys can do it. Show. Uh, so, do I reset one to you? No, wait, I didn't. Sure. About the need to surrender to us. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe that this is happening. It's ridiculous, almost stupid. But uh, you know what? It just makes sense to me, so I, I won't complain because. When you see this many people coming in to attack you, led by oh, Lu Bu, and led by like Xia Houtun and Sun Jian, I would say um, what they're doing is the right right decision. I mean, look at how many people are coming right now. It's the forces of um, Lu Bu and Cao Cao together in one go. I would just get on my knees, honestly. I would just like crumble and just be like, you know what? 
you're right. What we've been doing so far has been very wrong. We wronged you. We were obviously not thinking of you straight when we uh, decided to go against you. So, I, I think um, we should surrender, yep. Because what we're doing is very obviously wrong. I'm going to set this up. Obviously, in order to continue convincing people that what they're doing is wrong, you have to keep shitting troops. You can't convince anyone that what they're doing is wrong if you don't have troops. See, look. Master, good. Well, mean but now please go and convince these people that what they're doing is wrong. I'm coming. Whose forces is coming? Yeah, I'm gonna come over your face. I'm coming. Oh, what is this? Yang Bai Hu. I, Wan Yu, has come as an emissary on behalf of my lord, Yang Bai Hu. What do you need? I give you this gift? I'll take it. That'll make your surrender even more smoother. <laughs> My lord, Yu Bu, I carry all these scrolls to tell you this. Oh, what do you want? Tell me. I have come on behalf of my lord, Yu Bu, to recommend surrender. Please make the right choice for your people. Oh, man, who we submit here will we face those who die for our cause? Uh, we have no choice. We shall submit. The lesson we learned during Easter will be behind. Fine decision, Yu Bu, we're very happy with that. You and army collapsed. <laughs> oh man, I absolutely love making people get on their knees and surrender. All right, we're here now at Yi. Anyone who doesn't fucking surrender will be destroyed. Jinyang, that's my home province. We've done it. We now hold the entire Bing province and got everyone's effort. Bing province very mountainous, attacking is difficult, but defending will be easier. This region is suppressed. Yo, gee, Hebei will be ours. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Don't even have to fight. <laughs> I'm about to. I'm about to rot away because I'm not even fighting. It's terrible. I'm about to rot into a skeleton. But you know what? This is very funny, so I'm gonna keep this up. Man, now that this has happened, I don't need to do anything. I mean, it's developed into a situation where this dude yelling will be threatening enough to carry the weight of our words. Not the time yet. Well, maybe it'll be the time once these people join me. This is bad. I'm soon gonna run out of things to do because of what I'm doing right now. Shishie is large distance away. I think it's based on the distance traveled 
in order to um, cause people to um, surrender. So, we will get a little closer. Now that this has occurred, we probably don't have any, no, I mean, yeah, don't have any more need to go there. We will instead travel southwards. Vela. Hopefully we have enough food to um, supply for this ridiculous journey. What we're doing here is also the very definition of wrong. Absolutely deplorable. The definition of what is wrong. City government. Alright, I'm having you guys take care of this. Zhang Yan. Hao Zhao, Wu Huai, oh wow, we got a lot of people who just like join up on us. Kabinian, Kabinian. Dude, we got all these people joining us. Jesus Christ. We got all like. All the northerners, we got Ding Yuan, we got like old dad to join. Ridiculous. Well, to continue our um, our surrender spree, we will <sighs> go and tell these people to build barracks. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> this is terrible. Oh man, I should have never made. Alliances for this long. 15 months, 19, 18, 23. Well, we will go to the Wild Blessed soon. We might even just visit Simai through um, that path. But for now, we need to stay here and act as a show of force to convince these people that what they're doing is obviously wrong. And then we will travel down and we're going to visit Simayi, and we're going to tell him that what he's doing is wrong. And then we will deal with all kinds of nonsense over here in the left side. This is bad, though. I'm, I'm crushing this game. This is, like, almost overbearing. But it's also very fun, so I have no choice but to just keep doing this. Overbearing. Well... Oh made it submit to us save many lives go how we face those who die for our cause uh, uh tell them to go fuck themselves very well also suppose me boom Dauphin army collapsed oh <laughs> oh now you and shall Lord Yuan Shao, I've come today on behalf of my Lord Yu Bu. Oh, uh, huh, thanks for coming. What do you want? I've come on behalf of Lord Yu Bu to recommend surrender. Please make the right choice for your people. What? This matter's not even up for discussion. Flat do your views. Uh, we have no chance of winning. Submitting is our only option. Oh, this is lifted the weight of my shoulders and we're part together. Whoop! <laughs> Yuan Shao's army collapsed. Collapsed. It's just one after another after another. That's deplorable. It is an honor to meet you. I shall suddenly come on behalf of my lord Yubu. Oh, what do you want? You do not wish to perish. Please submit to Yubu's army. Please take careful consideration before you answer. Giving in to such demand leave our army's wounds. 
Uh, we have no choice, Winnie. Yep. Now that's gone too. <laughs> oh, what do you want? Uh, we will submit. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you get the fuck out of here. You want to stay in prison? You get the fuck out of here. Factions have gathered together in a coalition against Liu Bu under the leadership of Liu Yan. A coalition against Liu Bu has formed. Edited by Liu Yan. Let's see. Who exactly is part of this coalition? Everyone on the left side of the map. And she shit. Huh, I was right to come down then. Oh, I was right to come down. <laughs> Oh my god, this non-stop making people surrender nonsense has caused the, uh, has caused the world a lot of, um, disturbance, shall we say. I now have 450k troops. I could see why they would want to do this coalition against Liu Bu nonsense. That's, um, unfortunately gonna be a problem, you see, that's, it's gonna be a problem for you. <laughs> Good! Good! I will kill every last one of you. Appointment Duke. G Province. Yubu, all of G Province ours now. G Province the key central location of Hebei. Gaining this territory is a major advantage. Oh, please everyone, you do well. By this momentum is subject to Yo Province, Hebei will be under our control. I'm counting on all of you. Doo -doo. Appointment Duke. Duke, Duke, Duke Nukem. Duke, an envoy from Emperor, Emperor, see it. Emperor, Emperor. Notice of new title. Duke, I hereby appoint you the title of Duke by Imperial Decree. Please continue to serve for the glory of the Han Dynasty. Oh, thank you. So naive. <laughs> Congratulations on your new title of Duke! Ha ha ha! Our mission does not stop here. They prepare to work even harder. Oh, we should fight harder for you. Leave the army expansion to me. Into all administration duties without delay. I shall endeavor to reunify everyone behind you. Duke. Duke, Duke, Duke. Yeah, after that. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I've overdone it. Now, race loyal loyalty. Oh wow, Chen Gui joined me with a loyalty of 69. Uh, let's it. fix this. There's a huge group of people that are just kind of over the place. I need to start um, telling people that uh, there's nothing to worry about. We need to Zhang Hong. Gong Sun Du. I like how Dong Zhuo is the only one who is in. <laughs> Dong Zhuo. Amazing. Dong Zhuo. Amazing! This is just absolutely deplorable. A absolutely deplorable. Well, uh... Guess, you know, they don't accept surrender anymore, so uh, let's just kill them. Let's just kill them. 
don't want to surrender? <laughs> well then, I'm just gonna have to get rid of you the old-fashioned way. I hope you're ready. These mutated troops shall destroy you. Will not show you any mercy. <laughs> Alliance against Liu Bu. 86. <laughs> Even the Liu Biao big brother has turned. So there you go. Now I just need to destroy you. And literally the world right now is split in half. There is the Liu Bu faction on the right with allies. And then there is these guys to the left. The world has literally split into two right now. It's actually deplorable. And Dong Joel's like, Oh, you know what? I ain't joining no <laughs> coalition. You they tell them to go fuck themselves. I had people coal coalition against me before, so I understand your feelings very much, people. Very much. Once Kung Sun Tan falls, uh... <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm going in because I need to use this gold. You guys can, uh... I don't even know what you guys are going to do. Just, just go somewhere, I guess. Here, go north. Maybe that'll scare these people out of the wits. We'll see what happens then. We still have the yellow turbans here, but yellow turbans are pals. They, they've been our pals since the beginning. I am really sad that... Jesus has left this world because I, uh, I would have loved to walk, walk the path of peace with Jesus. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can no longer do that, but I will do so with his family, with his brother and all of his friends still at Ping Yuan. I will make sure that this world knows peace with my powers. This world will know peace. I will be the one who bring it. At any rate, let's see. How should we go about doing this? We have done just that. Alright, I guess we should go with that. Make sure that these people are geared up for war. Tell you what, Gearing up for war. A Daofan am feeling quite motivated to fulfill your expectations. Feeling quite motivated. <laughs> Alright. Once these guys get close, the surrendered troops will also march out to do battle. Now we're just waiting on Wang Wang and Kung Sun Zan's um, surrender. And once we get Kung Sun Du to surrender, we will march out to do great deeds. We're gonna have to cross over He Jin's territory. We still have about 14 months, so that's plenty of time for us to cross over, beat the living shit out of Sima Yi, and uh, we'll see where we go. A coalition. <laughs> uh, I hope they uh, actually know what they're doing. I need to move my court, court over there though all soon, so uh... Hmm. Here, you guys, you guys take a long time to get here, so just go inside. So then again... We might need you to do this anyway, so... There, get over to the gates over here. At this point, we probably don't even need to send these guys over. We'll just go here as well. I thought about it, but... This is already threatening enough to suddenly have all these people turn overnight. 
Yeah, Kung Soon too. I think it's better to just get on your knees, you know. Make this easier for yourself. The main problem now is how to transfer troops to the left once I have all this done. Now, this will be a, quite a uh, quite a thing. Well, I suppose I should be able to beat Simai quite handily, and then I'll transfer troops, a huge stack of troops, like seventy thousand in this city, if it's medium. Yep, seventy thousand, and that should be enough to subjugate the Wild West, because the Wild West has been very busy for the for quite a while. Now. Now, uh, out of their expectations, something horrible just happened. <laughs> well, that's it, I guess. Yan Bai Hu and his three. Hmm, I'm a little worried though, now that everyone's gonna fight me, I hope that I don't end up getting, like, people poached, because I am still freshly doing this, and this is not, like, something that is, um, easily just, you say, oh, we, we do, and then we do, it just isn't like that. Uh, I suppose for the time being, I should at the very least make sure that these territories are all producing troops. I've done so here and here. Let's see here. Yeah, <laughs> look how angry he is. He's raising his fist as he knows that the time is coming. But this dude hasn't even came back from his trip over to see me. Now he, he came to realize that his whole entire force has already joined me. Terrible. Well, Liu Biao, though, is part of my alliance, so... Angui! Eh, I thought that this might happen. But you know... It might not even matter, because he's just gonna join up with me again once we, uh, visit you. Believe me, you will be visited. Lots of people will be visited. Now, it's my turn. Let's go. Our pal. Pals should stay friends forever. Now, Yin Yang Yang Winto, get ready. Building barracks. Two demands are heading there. My forces are moving in. Chang Sha's forces is preparing. This time, they're just gonna straight up disappear. It's gonna be great. They will be blown away for not surrendering.
Very well, I shall submit. Yep. Long's army collapsed. Long Yuan Ji joined us. Oh, now Zhang Hong has made it over. Do not wish to perish, please submit to the Bu army. See, go oh, Chen Gui, you are just gonna come back to me. You are just gonna come right back to me. There's nowhere for you to go. <laughs> nowhere for you to go. Ooh, that's a fantastic item indeed. Oh, better search for it for me. Appointment King! <laughs> king! I'm gonna be King! Bibu! An envoy from Emperor Emperor Seed. Notice a new title. Bibu! I hereby appoint you the title of King by Imperial Degree. Please continue to serve for the glory of the Hot Dice. So nice. Congratulations, your new title of king! Bishop's in here. He says the same thing. King! <laughs> That's an absurd. Absurd, even. Absurd. We still have the conquering Yang province. We finished subjugating Yang Province. Good work, everyone. Yang Province is protected by the Yang Qi. The Navy will be important in order to take advantage of this location. Oh, you're right. I'll have to think about that as well. Doo doo! Oh, I'll have to think about that. No. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. And I can't believe what I'm doing here. It's disgusting. No. And you eat nicely. Look at this. It's gotten to the point where anyone could convince them to surrender. The distance is so close that they can just taste a beating that is about to arrive in their location, general location. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. All right, well, I'll send in the recommended man for the job. And, as usual... Yeah, look at these guys, they're so happy about this new job. They're even smiling. Ling Tong Dong Xi. There's no forces to advise surrender to. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Given rewards and everything, I have to play with my administration a little bit, but for now. Give this everything I've got. In 10 days, Gong Soon Du will probably surrender as well. And I will make new administrations. Ma Chao and Zhang Lu form an alliance. Submit to us. We have no choice. 
Gongshu Duel Army collapsed. That's the last one. Well, for now. Later on, Dong Zhuo will be another one. Have 21 orders, dude. 21 fucking orders. Now I'm gonna uh, use these orders for some crazy ass things. Conquering Yo and Hebei. We've done it! Now Yo province is under our control. Inhabited by northern nomads called the Wan. We must be wary of the Wan, but if we can control them, the land will become a powerful foundation for us. Move forward to put it on the Wibodo I agree. Doo -doo. <sighs> hey, what the fuck? I have Yo and Hebei. Why is it that I didn't get Hebei now? There we go. I cheated and get it from here. Oh, the fool finally took control of Hebei. Yeah, it will be good ever find the hard work. We shall ride this momentum right march south across the Yellow River for Zhongyuan. Honor to continue serving who with our lives. Mm, kind of more here. Yes! Yes! Dude! Getting doctrine EXP like crazy. Qing province, that's um, yellow turban. I have to get that from them later. Well done, now the Yu province is ours. Yu province is where the Gaishan, you may remember, founder Liu Bao defeated Xiang Yu, unified the land. Let's follow these steps. Okay, that's a good idea. <laughs> that's a good idea. I feel like a side character while the, these people explain everything to me. Gongxili, Jingzhou, Yang Province, Southern Jing, Nanjong, Zhongyuan. What's missing in Zhongyuan? Pingyuan, Luoyang. Okay, so we almost captured the entirety of that. There's a bunch of city expansion ones, that's something that will happen. Now, let us go do a reward. Reward systems activated. Even Tangui had no choice but to raise his loyalty to me after that. Now. Time to uh, oh, create a new division. The Northern Division. Although I'm still occupying Yi at the moment, and Puyang is needed because we're we've got a lot of other things to do there. This is the Northern Division. Tadun. <laughs> Got anyone who's better for this job? Let's see. Wen Xiao with a loyalty of 92. Tianfeng. A uh, loyalty of 92 with a charisma of 92. Tianfeng. Wen Chou Yang Yang. Hong Xun Zhan. I mean, I could have Yuan Shao do it, but that's silly. Let's give Tianfeng the job. Tianfeng is cool. And, I mean, it's not like he's going to do anything exciting. He's just going to sit and uh, prioritize on domestics anyway.
Int. Paisichi is back in action, I see. Guild time. Assistant scribe. I mean, they're not much different, except one isn't as good in politics. Oh, one has a lot of charisma, though. You know what, I'm gonna have guilt on be, be it, just in case something happens. I, I don't won't lose the entire of Zhong Yuan to that. Not to mention, he only has this few troops. Giving guilt on the position of Viceroy in Division 2. the campaign but now not that I need it because I've been very um, I've been very meticulous with this so I don't need to do that controlling troops here but I need these two troops here Support food division. <laughs> Ask only Red Seas for help, but she's uh, loyalty not high yet, so no. Bastion. You find. Ooh, you find that asshole. Ling Tung? No, I like Ling Tung. I think he's cool, so uh, Ling Tung, you're, you're gonna be my support. You're going to support me in this battle against the evil forces of a whole bunch of people. Actually, you know what? Go and attack CCS forces. Your priorities and troops, make sure it's done. Alright, Ling Tong is now going to help me fight the evil forces of Xixie. That leaves... me to command these troops to come out once our forces here have arrived. We'll build a camp right away. Let's see. We'll build it right here. Mm. Mm. The rest of these forces will take a while to get here, but we have enough food to last for a while. Actually, how much food do you have here? Not enough, so I guess I'll... Well, Changsha has quite a bit. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Because I want to get these uh, Tsai Song people free to do whatever they need. Go inside here first, and then... We will determine the following steps. Because these people are all from uh, Lu Zhang, and Lu Zhang has been uh, properly set as a stronghold. So once we get in, you will march out with Wei Yan and Wang Zhong to go and attack. <laughs> to go and attack, um, uh, what are they, uh, Liu Du. Liu Du, right? That's Liu Du. Yep, we'll go and destroy Liu Du and perhaps attack Shishia from a back growl as well. Let's see what happens here. I mean, Liu Biao is actually incredibly strong, so he should be able to hold off against um, Liu Bei's forces. But we don't need to worry about him. Domestics going to be on troops. Hey, Diao Chan, leaving you in charge of the troops. Honestly, these places are rich as it is, but I probably should tell them to also make troops. Because we haven't fought. None of us has fought. They 
just all surrendered to me, <laughs> so <laughs> none of us have actually fought, so uh, yeah, there, there's that. involved in this one and something days they'll do but not 30 days that's not a good idea that I can't give titles yet until we settle down and believe me we're not settling down until we defeat Simayi and make a uh, headway with it that's gonna be a little bit might even have to be next episode because I'm running out of time but we can at least finish this by having um, Sun Jian and Sun Che go enter the castle. Let's see here, what is this? Oh, I see. Campaign seems like a really bad idea, though. I'll just say this. Oh, then again, I've already asked for it. Target province, division, which base to deploy. How does this work? No units can be organized. So, uh... Anyway, once I become Emperor, that'll be even easier for my titles. And you know what? I, I think I'm on my well on my way to do that. Let's see what my city has 23. We'll take um, these two should be enough. Oh yeah, let me check my relationship status. 21 months, 13, 7, and once done, we will have Jesus and pals to join us as well, no problem, 7 months, we still have a while before we actually capture these territories. You know, I'm actually tempted to just haul stuff over now. Because I, I don't think we're going to keep a lot of gold, of our gold there. So I may just tell them, you know, to bring us some gold. And bring a hauler over. If Han fuck you do it. All this much gold, all this much supplies, all this much troops. Park here for a bit. Once we kick nah, Simai's ass, we'll push that shit in. No problem. After removing all that shit, we still have this much supplies, so we're good for a while. We have Roxanne and friends moving on this. We got a submission to make. Oh yeah, that's right. Good. Go visit Dong Zhuo. Tell them, hey, we're buddies. And they'll be like, okay, we're buddies. Oh man, I can't believe what I just did. It's disgusting.
，尽情欢呼吧！成功了。I'm sure these are not s o l i e 坚持易如反掌，现已完成任务。坚持易如反掌，任务成功。Surely you didn't come to tell me to get told this. Gotta be a special item in there somewhere. It moved. Though I could also be wrong. I mean, would be the first time. <laughs> You guys do it yourself. All right now, my order's down to 14. <laughs> now that I have uh, done that. <clears throat> okay, our army is about to make it over. Gotta wait for our siege weapons. Our hauler is on its way. A huge chunk of people. Oh. Oh. And that leaves me to go and probably just continue. Go. Zhang Lu. I, Yang Rin, will become the successor. What happened? How did he die? Oh, please listen. Dong Zhuo. Dong Zhuo. He did it. He did it. Dong. Look how happy he is as he's doing it too. Don't <laughs> draw. I was like, oh, isn't the left side a, co a coalition? And then I fucking forgot that don't draw is there, and he's killing people. Amazing, absolutely deplorable. Oh my god. <laughs> It's like, why would Zhang Lu die? <laughs> oh, fuck. Hey. Huge fan of Dong Zhuo. This is so stupid. That is why I'm a fan, just because it's stupid. <laughs> it's just so stupid. It's dumb. It's stupid. Absolute stupidity. Marching out? Oh yeah, they are. These angry men are coming out to do angry things. Oh. They're doing supply runs. Ah. <laughs> They're preparing for war. Once I touch down after defeating Sima Yi, I will be able to um, establish a new base in the western provinces. It opened, Adi. Six hundred and forty-four thousand. No, I'm getting to my way to one million, and when that happens, uh, I'm wondering how you're actually going to defeat me. Because uh, that's pretty deplorable.
Yeah, one, once I defeated Cao Cao, everything just kind of yeah. fell into place. It's just like, no more Cao Cao, then just, it turns into that. I mean, it wasn't me, then it's Cao Cao who's going to be able to do this. So, I have to do what I have to do. I mean, it's also the fact that, you know, I'm like, near Cao Cao, it has to be done. One of us wins. One of us dies. Oh shit, am I running out of wood? Oh shit. Oh, that's why God created merchants. That's a little too much, so I better watch out. Now I won't be making any more people surrender anytime soon, so this is fine. <clears throat> My lord Li Bu to speak with you. Thank you for coming. What do you want? Frost, Gokuryu, Prince. Oh man, we got some serious stuff that. I picked up from them. I guess uh, I take all of it. Alright then, I have to um, distribute this. I even took the Art of War. Oh shit, I took a lot of stuff. Here. Give. Don't draw this blue. This blue pouch of life extension. I want to tell him that, you know, I wish for you to live a long and meaningful life and. That it's the right one. Your medical tome. Yep. The book of blue pouch. Listen, I draw. I think you're a good man, and I wish for you to live a nice and long life. Well, Here's this pouch. Man, he'll see it, and then he'll be like, "Wow, dude, Lipu, I didn't realize. I mean, this much to you." Then he will shed a tear, and hopefully, then I can come to surrender. <laughs> That's basically what's gonna happen. If he won't surrender, then I'm gonna have to um, take back my gifts, and you know that that's a little. Uh, I'd rather not do that. That's just not right. Oh, I don't, I don't want to be forced into a position where I take back my gifts. I would be. Not to do. I'm about to enter the base. Once I enter Changsha, I will end for today. Because I've spent uh, too much time playing today. And, well, maybe not as much as I did the other days, but... Uh, today, I don't have enough time. So I will have to come back to this in a bit. Let's go. Even the hauler is on its way over. Yeah, we can establish a base that easily without them coming. So... Two thousand attack. Finally, for once, I actually get to um, embrace some of this power that Cao Cao has.
and pretty much everyone has fell in line. I see. I see. They've entered the base of Changsha. So now it's time to go in and adjust the division. Set it to four. Changsha's people will start working. And my people here from Lu Zhang will continue to be commanded by me. We should probably buy more stuff. Oh shit, we don't. Don't have enough. Don't have enough. Oh, but that's okay. We were getting a shipment of. Uh, oh wait, that's going to Taishan. Shit. Well, it's okay. I guess it's okay. It's okay. No problem. We have enough. Supplies, I think 76,000 is a lot and it's not like we're not gonna go straight and crush them anyway yeah it's like we're just gonna go straight there and crush the shit out of them and then we'll move away <sighs> troops of 38,000 that's not a problem for us 22,000 no problem for us in fact I didn't even have to do all this organizing but I feel like I should because out of respect for my opponents once I'm done, there will be stacks upon stacks of troops that never used to be there before. Then, we can start invading Shu proper. We'll probably lead a small force to uh, take down these ridiculous lands. lands. Then from there, we will work in the Shu from the south, which is much easier to handle than if we were to uh, attack, say, from up here and go through all this mountainous bullshit. But if we were to take the water route, going to Shu is actually much easier, and we can do this easily if we have Jing province under our control. Of course, Liu Biao will also have to surrender to us, but that's something that we don't worry about until 20 months from now. So that's a long time. Dangai, 15 months from now. Long time. 16 months. Yeah, these people won't be, won't be joining us anytime soon. Six months left in Zhang Bao. Hopefully he won't like immediately go and start swinging his fists in random directions, but I think... He knows better than that, considering that he's completely surrounded by troops on all sides. I know better than that, fuck with someone like that, so... It's, uh... Yeah, that's pretty much it, yeah. Having goodwill, I think I'm already sending some goodwill to, uh, the control, so that's pretty much it. These guys are all trusted with me, so if I ask nicely they will say yes hopefully like the rest of these guys up north we're ready to go and wrap up this campaign this is probably next episode i will probably end up taking all of the uh wild west maybe even the gateway and from there that should be easy it's just about invading shu Last time when I played as Dongbai, Shu was an incredibly dangerous and horrible trip. I should have never, never thought that it would be easy. In previous games, it was easy. But in this game, with all the supplies and shit like that, they make sure you understand just how difficult it is to invade Shu. Alright, so that's about it for today's episode. As I said, once I get these guys to Changsha, it's about time to end. I thank you all for watching, until next time.